Yo, what's up, Blastmaster KRS1? This jam is kicking. Word. Yo, what up, D Nice? Yo, what's up, Scott LaRock? Yo, man, we chillin' this funky fresh jam. I want to tell you a little something about us. We're the Boogie Down Production Crew. And due to the fact that no one outside there knew what time it was, we have to tell you a little story about where we come from. South Bronx, the South South Bronx, the South Bronx. People tell me this style is terrific. It is kind of different, but let's get specific. KRS One specialized in music. I'll only use this type of style when I choose it. Party people in the place to be KRS One attack. You got dropped off MCA because the rhymes you wrote was whack. So you think that hip hop had its star out in Queensbridge? If you pop that junk up in the Bronx, you might not live. Cause you're in South Bronx, the South South Bronx, the South Bronx. Scott LaRock to express one thing. I am a teacher and others are kings. If that's a title they earn, well, it's well deserved. But without a crown, see, I still burn. You settle for a pebble, not a stone like a rebel. KRS1 is the holder of a boulder. Money folder. You want a fresh style? Let me show you. Now, way back in the days when hip hop began, with Coca LaRock, Cool Herc, and then Bam. Boys ran to the latest jam, but when it got shot up, they went home and said, Damn, it's got to be a better way to hear our music every day. People was getting blown away, but coming outside anyway. They tried again outside and see the park. Power from a street light made the place dark. But yo, they didn't care. They turned it out. I know a few understand what I'm talking about. Remember, Bronx River, rolling thick. With cool DJ Red Alert and Chuck Chill out on the mix. When Africa Islam was rocking the jams. And on the other side of town was a kid named Flash. Patterson and Millbrook projects. Casanova all over. You couldn't stop it. The Nine Lives crew. The Cypress boys. The real rock steady taking out these toys. As odd as it looked, as Wallace has seen. I didn't hear a peep from a place called Queens. It was 76 to 1980. The dreads in Brooklyn was crazy. You couldn't bring out your set with no hip hop because the pistols would go. So why don't you wise up, show off the people in the place that you are whack? Instead of trying to take out LL, you need to take your homeboys off the crack. Cause if you don't, well then their nerves will become shot. And that would leave the job up to my own Scott LaRock. And he's from South Bronx, South South Bronx, South Bronx, South South Bronx, South Bronx, South South Bronx. Fresh for 86, 
suckers. Suckers. <laughs>